nutrition is big in people's lives. It's even bigger in your lawn's life. In the summertime, you shouldn't eat real heavy meals because it makes you, it makes you first of all, makes you too fat, that's number one, makes you tired, makes you sluggish. Well, it makes your yard and sluggish if you feed it heavy dry fertilizers all spring long, or all summer long. What you want to do is put it on a balanced diet on a regular basis, once every three weeks and before noon with a good liquid application of my all-purpose green up tonic. You want to remember, in the spring of the year, we took our bag of fertilizer, we put three pounds of Epsom salts in it, we applied it at half the recommended rate over the yard. That'll take care of it till October. So now what we're going to do is mix up the green up tonic and it will be applied every three weeks. And we're going to commence with a can of any beer. It can be flat beer, fresh beer, old beer, young beer, uh, alcoholic or non-alcoholic. One can of beer. Make sure that you mark your containers. We talked about it earlier for safety's sake. One cup of household ammonia. Household ammonia is a nitrogen source for your plants. What it does is it literally feeds it through foliar feeding as well as through the ground. A half a cup of any liquid dish soap. Dish liquid dish soap. Uh, softens the soil, washes off pollution, so osmosis and photosynthesis take place, and that's what we want because that's your one a day for your plants. A half a cup of any liquid lawn food, and that's your one a day vitamin. So we want to make sure that it's a good, healthy one, and make sure it's fresh. Don't don't use one that you've had around forever. And a half a cup of clear corn syrup, or you can use molasses. That's your sugar source that feeds the bacteria, which then feeds the dirt. Uh, which feeds the bacteria that feeds your plants. That's all mixed together. Stir well and pour into your hose and sprayer. And any that you have left over, you can use into the next batch. So don't make, don't worry if you got too much. That goes into your hose and sprayer. You then put the lid on that. This is a 20 gallon hose and sprayer, which means when 20 gallons have passed over the top of this sprayer bottle, it is empty. You attach it to your ho to your garden hose, and every three weeks before noon, you feed your lawn. You'll have the greenest grass on the block on your side of the fence. Your trees, shrubs, evergreens, and flowers will love it just as well.